Yes, exactly. It's my house. And I will be nude in it. Imagine all the times I've lounged on your couch. <laughs> <laughs> So what are we doing? I'll tell you what we're doing. We're gonna be styling PJs into actual outfits to wear out into the world. So Lindsay and Jasmine also did this pajama challenge, but they styled two outfits, one for day, one for night. We're just gonna style one outfit that transitions well from day to night. You can add like a couple of accessories to like make it into more of a night look. Like if you want to throw a heel on and you're like, ooh, night, that works too. I love pajamas. I don't wear PJs. I think in 2017, I vowed to only start wearing matching PJs to bed. I grew up in the Midwest where it got cold at night, so I was always rocking like matching flannel pajama sets, which is really cute. Now I mostly just wear like boy shorts and like some type of anime t-shirt when I go to bed. The second I get home, it's <laughs> Now, some PJs that I have, they are like, you know, short sleeve or like a longer sleeve because that's when I'm like on vacation with multiple people. And so like, I don't wanna, you know, give too much of the store away for free. The shop is closed. The shop is open for business. I have seen the types of pajamas that like people are wearing these days. Okay, I have some fashionable people in my life and I gotta tell you, Pajamas are in right now. The one thing is, if I'm eating food, I have to be wearing clothes. I won't eat food naked, cause like, that just kind of feels like a step too far for me. Which is why Brian always laughs, cause I'll always put on a shirt and like underwear just to eat food. And then as soon as I'm finished eating food, I'll take them off. I'm gonna go do some shopping. Freddie gave me $4,000. And because I said it out loud, she I can hold her to that. So I gotta get pajamas. So today's the morning in which I'm gonna be wearing pajamas as outerwear to work. I thought it would be cool to show you the pajamas that I usually wear. So this is something that I wear basically when I sleep normally. But the pajamas that I'm gonna be wearing today are right here. I already have a vision. I really like pajamas that make you look dignified. Like the kind that you'd see like an old person with like a cigar and some scotch wearing in their personal library. It's a cute little shirt that says prickly in the morning. It's got cactuses on it. And then it's got cute little cactus thing shorts. It's August. So as skippy as I can get because it is so hot. I'm hot right now. Look, it's my pajamas. Yeah. I gotta, yeah. I gotta style it for day. My PJs came in the mail. So I think the look I have in mind is gonna be a little less sexy and a little more PJ, especially because, you know, obviously we work at BuzzFeed and sort of anything goes at the office, especially if you're doing it for a project. I went with like a classic PJ look, matching top, matching bottom. Okay, so as you can see, I stopped recording when I was at my house because I accidentally only ordered the top to my PJ set. So now I'm pulling into the mall parking lot to try to find a last minute replacement for my PJ day. And I'm a little stressed out, but let's see what we find. So I'm gonna be wearing a cute little outfit today. I'm just gonna style these new pajamas in uh, my regular style. So I'll just put a little bit of foundation on. I have some cute little gym shoes I'm gonna wear. And I feel like it'll be a good look. And it's Kristen. What do you Wait. think? I don't know how I feel about this. It kind of feels like the same color. Chantel's nodding. I, I am nodding. <laughs> They're all very cute, like individual pieces, but I think it is a little bit just one tone. Matchy matchy. Yeah. I like the denim, the idea of a denim skirt, but it's not the right color denim. Yeah. Okay, fine. I will go back to the drawing board. So I found a set that I think could work. It's this and shorts. Super cute, my vibe, as you can tell. But they don't have it in my size. Ah. I also have to stop at the grocery store this morning before heading into the office. We'll get a little sense of whether people think it's weird what I'm wearing. I don't think they will. So I picked up a pair of PJs that I like. I asked one of the employees if I could just buy the PJs and then change in the changing room and then wear them out of the store. She was like, yeah, that's fine. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna put together my day look with my PJs right now. I already feel weird walking around the mall in PJs. Like I feel exposed in a way. They're not scandalous PJs, they're regular PJs. I think it's probably just because I can feel my booty wiggle. I picked this outfit because I wanted everyone to know that I'm bisexual and I feel like there's no other way to better remind them. And why is that? Well, okay, so I took this and I tied it and then but I also have these little pink pants. So it's like, I kind of wanted everyone to know that like I am femme and I am here and available for friendship. <laughs> she looks good. <laughs> Hey, Kristen. What? Where'd you get that ass? <laughs>
at Costco. Um, so this comes to set. So I'm wearing the top part and I'm wearing the bottom part. To transition into your night look. Yes. Also, the two of you are sort of like Cordering. of like mine. Because we're both doing like cactus themed pajamas. Cactuses are a big thing in pajamas this season. We're prickly in the morning. Why'd you choose this outfit, Jen? I chose this outfit because it really did just look like honestly like an outfit you might wear out and about. I thought the shorts were really, really colorful and I love the color blue. It honestly seemed like something I would wear when I was a child. Like my mom would have put me in this and sent me off to school. Oh, look at this cutie. Hi. Look at this little thing. Like, oh, look at these little specs. Grab this little set. This kind of looks like PJs to me. I don't think it does. Don't think so. It looks like a, like a romper slash pantsuit. It looks like you're going to Palm Springs. As I walk around and sashay through the world, yeah. I just feel like loose. Loose is a good way to describe it because I noticed that when I'm sitting in chairs, I have to be very cognizant of like where my legs are because it just wants to like reveal Free. Thank Troy you, Troy. has a opinion. <laughs> what do you think, Troy? I love it. You guys look amazing. Did you know we were wearing PJs? No. Oh, I can see it. what do you think of my outfit today? I think you look like a little Jammy Jammerson. <laughs> a little Jammy Jammerson. I love it. I got you. Thank you. Could you tell that I'm wearing pajamas? Uh, not until I took like a really good look and I was like, wow, are those pajamas? Yeah. They look really good. Now it's time for me to change into my night look. Ooh, what's your night look? I'm not gonna, I know, I'm not gonna show you. It's hiding under my shirt. Ooh, ooh, ooh. ooh. Ooh, I could unbutton it slowly, <gasps> but, but then you'd see the surprise. Oh my god. Um, do it, please! Look who showed up! You just been inked all day! What's up? How's it going? How yeah. are you doing? I'm great, thanks. Yes. Yes, hello ladies. Looking cute for a Wednesday happy hour. It's Thursday. Looking Thursday. cute for a Thursday happy hour. <laughs> Let's talk about your, your outfit, even though you forgot your hat. I forgot my hat. I was gonna wear a black bucket hat to complete the look because I ran out of hair gel. But I have a purse and I have a new top because that's what you do in the night. You change into a butt down and you wear a purse. Femininity. I'm Femininity. I know, I hear you. Jen is fem now. I'm doing the pajama bottoms with the top. Love it. And the wedge. Well, wait a minute, is this the top that goes to the pants yes. that wore earlier? Yes. Oh, you did a little switcheroo. I did. She did. Now, I decided to go with a combat boot situation, Ooh. leather jacket situation, a side hair situation. I love it. I really love it. Dangly earring situation. Wow, you're doing a better job than me. I basically just like, and now the top is big. <laughs> <laughs> no, I think everyone looks so cute. Should we go get some bevies? Yeah. yeah. I see, I can't, I'm not looking, so, oh, oh, oh. <laughs> cheers. Ooh. Yo. You're drinking water. You don't know that. <laughs> it's vodka on the rocks. <laughs> Back from drinks with Friday and Kristen, still wearing my pajamas. I gotta tell you, wearing pajamas for a day, so easy. Pajamas are probably the most comfortable thing anyone could wear. Styling them, I didn't feel like it was that difficult. Hot take. Hot take. Hot take. Hot take. I almost like this little pajama ensemble better than the original one that I picked. It has a little bit more personality. It's really cool, kind of vintage. Like the colors are really fun. I was able to kind of play around a little bit more with my accessories. Maybe it was a blessing in disguise that I didn't order the full PJ set that I thought I did. Listen, I'm lazy and I'm cute. So really this video was a good way to honor both sides of that identity for me. Plus I was able to like take what was already a cute daytime cord and turn it into like three outfits instead of one. Styling PJs for day and night. Lady, lady tested, tested, lady lights out. out. Did someone say? <laughs> Bedtime. <laughs> Talk to me, what's going on? <laughs> what's going on, girl? Why are we filming vertically? You want me to get a photo of you from the back? Yes. Oh wait, <laughs> I was not expecting that. Do you have a tissue in your hand? 